Hello everyone, J Reese, aka T Swift here, and I'm showing you how to fix the error where you try to install the World of Warcraft beta or the Diablo 3 beta. And it gives you that little thing where it pops up for updating files and stuff and just gets stuck there. And it won't either won't install the game or it won't launch the launcher. So what you want to do is go to your start menu here, go to computer, and I'll just double click this. And what you want to do is go to program data but that might not be showing so if it's not go to organize up here folder and search options view and down in here where it says hidden files and folders make sure this is checked just hit apply and OK and then you go into program data there should be a battle net folder here you're just going to want to go ahead and delete that and then you go into the blizzard entertainment folder it should be right down below that Battle net folder. Go into here. There's another battle net folder inside of that. You don't want to delete that. Just go into that. There's going to be a cache file. Delete that. And then you're going to want to reboot your computer. I'm not going to do that right now because I'm recording. But after you've rebooted your computer, you want to go ahead and locate where the installer is the World of Warcraft or Diablo 3 beta setup installer is. For some reason, I have two here. Uh, right click it. Let's go. Just gonna want to right click it, go to properties, compatibility, and make sure run this program in compatibility mode is checked. You want Windows XP Service Pack 3. If you try to use oops, if you try to use Service Pack 2, it will give you an error on the launcher that says this operating system isn't supported so upgrade your operating system and then you want to make sure to run this program as its administrator is checked click OK then you run it just click run it'll get stuck here say updating files and checking for updates it'll do that run through this normally then it should launch the beta launcher and there you go and just hit install it'll install it's the same exact process for the Diablo 3 beta. Um, after that, I would go into properties for the beta icon. I'll go to compatibility to make sure that is also checked, just in case. I mean, I haven't any, had any problems running it out of compatibility mode, but it's better to be on the safe side. Hopefully this fixes.